okay students so in this class uh, let us solve a problem on linear transformation so in this question we have to find the linear matrix of the linear transformation right this is the linear transformation and uh, this is from r2 to r3 we can say that r2 is the domain and r3 is the codomain <coughs> so here uh, the basis for domain is given that is 1 comma 1 and 3 comma 1 and the basis for the codomain r3 is given that is 1 1 1 1 1 0 and 1 0 0 so uh, to find the matrix of this linear transformation so look at the domain and codomain the dimension of the domain is 2 the dimension of codomain is 3 so the matrix of this linear transformation will be 3 cross 2 right so first observe the domain domain is r2 and observe the basis for the domain it is 1 comma 1 and 3 comma 1 and you know d of x comma y so using this given data first find t of 1 comma 1 and t of 3 comma 1 so we got t of 1 comma 1 now so what is t of 1 comma 1 put x equal to 1 and y equals to 1 what happens x plus y so 1 plus 1 is 2 x equals to 1 and 3 into 1 minus 1 okay if i substitute x equal to 1 and y equals to 1 I will get a t of 1 comma 1 right so it is a 2 1 and a 2 so 3 minus 1 that is 2 so we have to uh, express this vector as the linear combination of the basis of the codomain right because 1 comma 1 it belongs to the domain right and t of 1 comma 1 it belongs to the codomain r3 so we can express that vector as the linear combination of the basis elements Right. So let me write this 2, 1, 2 as the linear combination of 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 0 and 1, 0, 0. Here A, B, C are scalars. Here they are real numbers. Okay. Now uh, let us multiply A here, let us multiply B here and let us multiply C here. So let us operate the first tuple element. So it is A plus B plus C. So while operating the second tuple element we have A. We have b into 1 b and we have c into 0 is 0 so that is a plus b only and here we have a into 1 plus b into 0 plus c into 0 that is a only so in this equation we can say that uh, uh, we can equate this equation so we can say that uh, a plus b plus c equal to 2 a plus b equals to 1 and a equals to 2 so directly a equals to 2 is given so we have to substitute that value here to get the value of b and we know a and b let us substitute those values here to get the value of c fine so we got this linear transformation what is the next step so we have a second basis element so let us calculate t of 3 comma 1 okay so uh, we have to express that also as the linear combination of these three elements like this okay so let us consider t of t 3 comma 1 so that is put x equal to 3 and y equals to 1 see x equal to 3 y equals to 1 3 plus 1 which is 4 and x equal to 3 and 3 into 3 9 9 minus 1 8 so we have this vector and again we have to express this as the linear combination of 1 1 1 1 1 0 and 1 0 0 now uh, let us uh, solve this let us multiply this p here let us multiply q here and let us multiply r here so we have this on equating we have this so we can say that uh, 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 p plus q plus r equal to 4 uh, p plus q equals to 3 and uh, 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 p equals to 8 right so we have these values now and uh, now uh, we can write the coefficient matrix so now we can calculate the coefficient matrix of t so here we have the coefficients a b c and we have p q r let us consider that as the matrix here and we know the values of a b c and p q r let us substitute that so that this is what this is the coefficient matrix of t now to calculate the matrix of the linear transformation it is enough to calculate the transpose of this coefficient matrix so the matrix of the linear transformation will be matrix of linear transformation will be so the first row 2 minus 1 1 so that it will be the first column and 8 minus 5 1 that will be the second column so this is the required matrix of linear transformation and you have to observe one more thing here and you have to observe one more thing here if in the question if the basis is not given you have to consider the standard basis 
so for the, the standard basis of r2 is 1 0 0 1 the standard basis of r3 is 1 0 0 0 1 0 and 0 0 1